<laughs> now, Paul, you grew up in what I would consider to be quite a conservative religious household. Yeah. Do, do you look back on it? Was it a strict upbringing? Well, there's, you're af afraid of a lot of things when you're in that kind of an environment. Yes. And we were on vacation once when I was about 10 or 11, and we were in, in the Bahamas, and there was a radio playing, and the DJ goes, well, everyone knows that uh, when you masturbate, you lose a year off of your life. <laughs> and I was like, no, a day off your I'm sorry, a day off of your life. <laughs> I know. I mean, we'd all be dead. Uh, um, and so I looked at my parents thinking they were going to go, oh, and my dad looked at my mom and they kind of raised their eyebrows at each other. And I took that as, oh, he just, he told the truth. And so I spent the rest of my next 20 years basically, um, you know, kind of dealing away my life. Like, okay, well, I could lose that week. I wouldn't need that. <laughs> I guess, I, you know, when I'm 75, I can get out of here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of bargaining went on. And, Aww. Yeah, very sad. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> if it turns out to be true, though. <laughs> I would definitely be dead by now. <laughs>